Hello and welcome back to Hearts Farm 4 with our uh, Great War Mod campaign, yada yada yada, plan thingy, mabob, and well, basically, we are playing a game where uh, some guy keeps dying all the time. Can't remember his name though. Alright, let's take a look at logistics. Alright, so we've got a lack of transport vehicles, so we need more of those. And I need more field guns. Uh, so let's start with a transport vehicle. I've got enough support equipment, so I think if I keep running at two, I will be fine. So I'm just going to switch this out to field guns. Transport, need a little bit more oil. We'll take some from... Uh, well, Soviet Russia will do. We are at war with Russia again. This means a lack of oil, by the way. Um... Got some available planes. These are mostly fighter planes, so I think for that we are fine. Let's take a quick look at our air map mode. It's not really any enemy air presence available anywhere. So I'm not overly worried about that. Now, what would be nice if the Spanish would enter our war on our side, but they are Democrats. Hmm. Let's see. Well, I can't really say she coup from two hurts them. I'm gonna lose England in this war, I think. Might actually not. Might just get the Union of Britain, keep them right there and take the rest of it. I don't know. Some submarines are here. Ah, they must be the ones that are sinking my uh, convoys that go to Britain. The assholes. Anyway, let's continue going and uh, yeah. You know, get control over the situation. All right, push them back in. You know, push them towards their harbors. Let's see, something like that. Push in you. You technically both don't have orders, so you should become a little bit more. Okay, we we'll wipe off a couple more squads. France. Oh yeah, France Josef. That's the one who keeps dying. The undead. Emperor Franz Josef, which by now has been on that throne far longer than he is supposed to be. I've been trying to look into it how that event can be fixed, but um, sadly enough, I have no idea. Albania, you've came into existence. Oh, that's interesting. Missing equipment production is still the close air support fighters. That's not a problem. Okay, so you guys take care of that little itsy bitsy problem over there. And I want you guys, um, there's still some work to be done here. Uh, start working on that, you guys. Uh, you need an, uh, technically you need a front to attack on. Alright, so we are doing pretty good over here. I got initial focus, ready to go, roaring to go. What do we have left? Well, not that much. A couple of naval things, so yeah, let's do that. Naval gun effort. Port strikes that are happening. Nice, nice. Everything that is nice. So submarines attacking submarines. Apparently that's not really working that well. It's just stuck, apparently, up on another. Let's see, how are we in the factory business? We're still mostly repairing factories, so that's why I'm not, you know, adding on more. Um, it's still just a problem of, okay, factories that need to be repaired. Mostly still in France. I rarely do this, taking control of a situation uh, to, to place these forces, but but now it becomes such a annoyance that I think we kind of have to. Um, see, there are forces going there as well. There are some convoy... I'm going to put another convoy fleet somewhere. Probably just around this line to protect these borders a little bit more. Because we are losing some convoys here occasionally, which is annoying. Alright. Uh, speaking of annoyances, are you ready to do this? Try and try again until, you know... We can get our grubby little mitts on that attack. It isn't a difficult attack, I'd get that. We should win this at some point. 
Come on. Oh wait, he's transported more forces in there by now. Well, damn. Well, damn. Um, so fleet is getting up to date. All right. Let's see how far we can go. Seems that. Uh, how can he get more forces on the island? That's silly. Okay, I need. Is my submarine fleet not here? Oh, that might help. Prevent them from moving any more forces there. Actually, you know what? I don't care much about the Ublo flotilla here. Just prevent them from moving any forces. I don't know where they're coming from, but I want them sunk. Carlos, the new emperor. We've got delay tactic, which uh, does what now again? Flugzeug Dampfer 2. Uh, just basic organization. Um, there we go. Yeah, we're gonna specialize a lot more in tanks when we get the chance. We're in 22. This is 29. Plus these take how long? Yeah, about two years. Yeah, it gets a bit I mean, larger ahead of time, but I don't think see the purpose of it just that much there. The life tractor would be nice to have, but that goes for a lot of these things. It's only 30, that's even way more ahead of time. I think we just gotta stick with the doctrines for now. This is 36, the rest of it is already on research or re being researched. This is 24. It takes about a year to research, which gives them about yeah, some barely ahead of time. It's uh, you know what, this albatross actually is some proper research that we can do. So let's do it. Okay, so they're still destroying these factories, which is annoying, but... Um, good. Some, some forces will be wiped here. Go. You took care of those guys, and... Right, I just got a Russian border here. That's not really what I was looking forward to. Some Japanese invasion behind me, because of course that is what's going to happen. These minor invasions all the time. Please don't get locked up in a naval combat. They didn't. Good. Okay, so I need one of these. Okay, so this guy is going to go Russian border, I think. Seems the uh, Turks managed to get a tank company up and running. It's actually owned even by the Ottoman Empire. Okay. Um, just kick him out and... Kick him out, thank you. Uh, okay, good. Your mission, which you choose to accept it, is to... Just... Be... There. And kick out... The... Russians. Now, I believe there is actually some oil there. Yes, there is. So this is actually something that I want to get done really quickly. What else do we got here? We've got the dark red guys. I think I can give you new orders to assist with that attack as well. After you're done with your current attacks. Carl is the new emperor. Well, well welcome back, Carl. Seems that he and his father are kinda doing their own thing right now. So there's only 14 of you left. That's not true. There's 10. But I just need to get them back all right. Okay, but there's no harbor here, so they should just die off at some point. At some point, but the amount of forces concentrated here is a little bit silly. Okay, is there anything here left? Uh, let's just zoom out a little bit, because I don't have need to need firepower in the background all the time. 36. 36. Well, doctrines is something we can do. Okay, uh, I think navy by now is one of the more important things that we can focus on. Because it's the navy where... Russian Empire has capitulated. What? the hell? They have. But they're not out of this war, just... Ah, there we go. Can I take anything of it? I could. Is there anything here? Some buildings, but there are no... There's oil here. Chromium. Uh, 
Can I do like liberate satellite? Republic of China. Oh. Okay, wait a minute here. Can I get some? Nepal becomes a settler. Man, will we immediately be attacked by them? Bhutan. Okay, so let's start with that. It will satellite Nepal. And I will be done, because I don't care much for the rest of it. So, the Russian Empire got... Let's see. They are part of the white movement still. But how does it work? How did they survive? Nobody took any land from them? Huh. Surprising. Well, sure, I don't mind. Um, that means these forces are not able to do anything anymore. So, yay. Don't care about the close air support, don't care about the free military factories right now. It means you guys now go towards the Middle Eastern Theater. So stack up there. And push that out. I need to reorganize this entire battle line, don't I? Yeah, I kind of do. All right, I'll get to that soon. All right, you lost the attack again. Gonna keep trying. The submarines should, by all means, just take care of this at some point. Naval mission efficiencies. Wish I could get more control over the situation there, but... Um, there's just ships and submarines here. Uh, can I just put you guys on patrol and just start intercepting these uh, submarines and ships and that kind of crap? Ah, good. We now are finally going to stop the attack. Put some guys on it. Let them prepare. Get them ready for it. Naval guns are ready. The dreadnought effort. There's some quicker research going on here. Should also just prevent any more reinforcements from coming in. Seems to be far more effective than the submarine so far. There we go. Uh, do you guys even got any preparation going on? Bhutan has capitulated. Yeah, that's what I was afraid of that would happen, but you know some point it will be fixed. Okay, so we got a large battle going on. These forces are gonna wipe at some point. We'll get us more access to those armies. Uh, I don't need these guys all here. Uh, how are Russia and me thinking one another? We... Russia kinda likes me. They hold our core provinces. Uh, you probably consider some of this core Russia. Yeah, thought so. Um, but I, I highly doubt that we will go to war for over that. Um, yeah, I think we should make time for the Africa campaign. Um, I'm gonna garrison some, some guys here. Uh, and I'm gonna go make a new theater. Africa. There we go. And... Let's see, this and with some of the Russian guys. You can also go to the Africa Theater. And I want you to also stack up somewhere around there. They're gonna initiate landings in Tunisia, I believe. Would you could call this, or is Tunisia over here? Tripolitina. I think Tunisia is over here. Okay, so naval guys, how are we doing? Nepal has capitulated, and that's the island. We they must have been trying to take off the forces, um, you know, get them off, but uh, you know that doesn't work that well when there are ships preventing anything from really landing. Well, next stop, Gibraltar. Let's get these guys in position, and. Uh, 
a large naval presence there, I think we should be fine. Uh, not be worried too much about anything of it. Um, these guys are just present there. They're not really that important. All right, drop more of the MPs. How is the resistance going? It's getting better. Oh, we fixed some of the resistance up north here. How is that possible? How could that not be burning? Daily growth is minus due to militarism, Baron from Bulo. Uh, gentle. Right, might be, I might want to go in France and let's see. Uh, manage occupied territory, Belgium, this is all gentle, 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 gentle. France is kind of harsh. Um, let's go with gentle and see how that resolves some of the issues. It might just kill off a lot of factories that I had for production. Not really. Just lost seven factories, but that's about it. Would make things a lot easier. All right, let's start repairing the military factories again. Okay, um... Does this list needs to be organized once in a while. There we go, I think it's good now. It should get better. Occupations and all. Just keep building them for now. Um, landings, great. Um, you guys, you're considered Middle East Interior Theater, but you have no points to do anything. You're gonna kick down all of these landing points everywhere. Okay, go. Right, next up, organizing this foster clock. Um, your home. Is that this? No. That will be... Where? These guys. Okay, so you have a... You're defensive. Right, that means you have a front line here. That is... Should be no divisions. There we go. One of you has 21 divisions. That's a big view. There we go. 20. Okay, that means all of these are assigned at the correct position. And they're gone there. Use my hand. Alright, dog red. I want you to stack up. Not there. Oh, that's the wrong border you're uh, thinking of there, mate. Dark red. Oh, come on. You did it again. Oh, this is not a permanent border province. Well then, just these two. Your tasks are striking through this hard land. Go. Purple. Can delete all your orders. I'm gonna stack you up right about there. You are going to go for the other bit. Go. And there's light blue. I'm gonna delete your orders. You're gonna stack up right there and push for. Wow, this is a lot bigger than I was anticipating. Um, push for that. I will get another division to take care of this down there. These guys just aren't mostly defensive right now. All right, good. Got that worked out. All of you are ready to rumble, good. Uh, Western Europe, these are just defensive armies. Let's see, there's the Gib this island here that needs to fall. Um, when the invasion of Gibraltar done, I'm gonna make a little front with these uh, guys um, so that they can just stack in armies there. Navy is getting good, by the way. I'm really glad that we've started investing in the Navy. We've repaired some of it, though, but, you know, it's getting better and better. 
It's going to be important that we keep these areas patrolled. I think these two are very important. We take in the third. We'll, when we get control, because our submarines can sail in, but we have no control here. So our Atlantic Navy cannot. We need to get no control over this. That's where, you know, my, my awesome guys are coming in, but they are making preparations, so that should be good. And let's do a little work on our light tank. 3's A. Yeah. The final points in armor up there. So we got the B's. B variants. Alright. Awesome. I don't think we're that much on low manpower. Not as much as, you know, they claim we are. Uh, do a fullback line. I don't like using fullback lines for this. Um, it makes it a little bit easier. But normally with garrison they ch choose ports. Uh, enemies tend to invade by ports. There we go. Got some guys stacked up along the line. It should prevent. Russian Federated Empire declared war on the Ottomans. The Ottomans are my allies, so... So they just got back. Wait, was Romania allied with France? They must be neutral, right? They're no part of the Entente, but they're friendly with France. So, are you back in the Entente? No, you're at white movement. This is once again a separate war. Can I call? Uh, you guys are, of course, unable to. You would have. You would if you had no faction. Strategic reasons to ally us. Yeah, well, whatever. Um, okay, so this gets done slowly. This doesn't look right, though. Uh, you guys. Uh, you. All of you should be there. Actually, none of you should be on that front. Same goes for the others. You have your tasks. It seems to be... Now this looks like the biggest faster clock I've seen in a while. Um, you. Just... Downside of garrisoning, garrisoning is that they prior, prioritize all... Um, uh, strategically important positions, but that means cities inside land, uh, they get prioritized as well. Which is sometimes fairly annoying. Uh, do you have an attack here? Is this yours? I don't know. Let's just delete your orders real quick. So it wasn't yours. Um, you can stack up there. And strike for that. Very nice. Now I need to take a quick look at you. You are good. Yes, you're fine. Um, let's get you all in the, there. So that means that... Got an order without. And then there's this pink... These pink guys. Change your front line. Shrink it. There we go. Good. Just keep on going, everybody. Right, Pacific Front. These guys are holding the line. Good. This is the Republic of China, which is just exists twice now. Part of it, though, is our puppet, which is nice. Um, they will, at some point, start making forces, but, you know, who gives a shit? They've got one factory. It's just, it's just so awesome. This, however, looks like a bad idea. The entire front line is so thin. Alright, so you... Have you ever got your own faction? No, you're not in a faction, but you will not join me because... Different ideology, base reluctance... Protected towards France, towards Portugal. They like France and Portugal. Well, Lottie, fucking duh. 
Anyway, I oh, can't deploy you yet. We have not been really progressing time that much, actually. Alrighty. Just waiting for you now. And you've been stuck up there. He will become part of the Africa for at some point. Okay. Just kicking the UK out of Iraq and Kuwait. Franz Josef died. Oh no. The humanity. There we go. Just get this tank uh, to insist in this final push. Alrighty then. That's awesome. That gets t that takes care of that. That gets a lot of armies that are needed on this front. I can help with this little push. Another army there that can help with this little push. Another army there that can help with uh, stack up there and help with this little push. Go 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 go. And again, they get the tanks. Let's get them into action for once. There we go. But I, idea that I can complete naval gun effort three will do the trick. And I need some resources. Well, Soviet Russia just became a lot bigger. Get some trade with him. Uh. Let's just get one factory that makes a little bit more sense. Get another factory from Soviet Russia. That's not what I wanted to do. There we go. This gets us a little bit of a surplus, which is fine. All right, how are we looking at destroyed factories? They are not getting added on as much anymore, it seems. Things are slowing down. Good. Uh, I remember one of you saying there was a method of assigning these armies automatically after deployment. I don't know how it was... Ah, right. I can assign them to a front automatically. And now they will automatically get... Oh, that's interesting. Not enough equipment to train. You probably want... What? What's your problem? Should be more than enough equipment. Field guns are in short supply, but they are getting there. Same goes for light tanks, but they are getting there. I just kind of need them to push. Okay, factories are being repaired. Why haven't you done the invasion bit yet? Go, go, go. Uh, stretch pull have been blocked. Really? So I cannot invade that from this side because I cannot move through? <sighs> okay, I regard that as a bit silly, but sure, I'll deal with it. That means the naval invasion needs to go from that port to Gibraltar. Doesn't really bother me that much because I have naval superiority, but it's just kind of silly. A little bit, just a little bit. Sinking convoys, that's good. I'm gonna put you a little bit. No, this seems fine actually. This is perfectly fine. Right. Okay. Um. I need one elite army here. Uh, you should have a front. Where are you assigned on? Some of you must... Okay, so you have a mission. Where are you? Go there, idiot. Same goes for you. Both of you, just go there for crying out loud. Less burning around. Good. Still some getting sunk there, but uh, I guess. Okay, good. So there's three little islands we need to invade afterwards. Um, these three islands here. Um, then there will be an invasion of uh, Crete. Or Cyprus, I mean, sorry. That's completely wrong. Take care of that real quick. That just should free up some more stuff. 
and that should change the front lines a little bit in not really in my favor okay so we got a problem again if I can push you just downwards real quick get the tanks okay so first of all you delete all your orders and stack up on that front line um, Okay, just gonna delete a lot of stuff here real quick because this is a big fuster plug. You get there. I mean, all of you just go there, man. I don't know where else you were stacked up. Oh, right, you're these guys. Never mind. Never mind, you're not supposed to be there. You, you can do that. Can you? I think you can. Then there's a you that needs to do this thing whatever you want to call it I want you to assist with that there we go I want you to join this defensive border here a little bit of reorganization all of you can just can I not do this easier no, I need to do pro army. Uh, hold, 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 hold. There we go. It should cause all of them to move. Okay, just make sure that uh, that guy dies. There we go. Right, good. Everything is set up. Nutrition there is horrendous, though. Uh, yeah, we'll go with the airplane. Why not? Wait, you're not supposed to move, and you're not supposed to move. There's little to no equipment there, gents. Um, I think you uh, can have that. All right, airplanes. Where do I have my airplanes active? Actually, I'm going to end the video first. Uh, I want to thank you guys for watching. See you guys next time. Have a very good day. Bye-bye.